You get out tomorrow, as soon as we catch Franklin, you're coming back. You know, I can't promise anything, but maybe uh, for your cooperation, the parole board will be nice to you and give you two years instead of five. Of course, if you do take off, I lose my badge and end up in prison, so you're going to be under surveillance pretty much every second that you're out of here. I'm going to need a gun. Well, that's not going to happen. Then the deal's off. What are you telling me? You're not going to take this deal? After what Franco did to Sam, you, you want to do, you do anything to uh, catch I'm not going to help anybody if I let Franco kill me. And for all I know, that's your plan. You shove me out there as bait, Franco kills me, you try to catch him, and you won't, by the way. But what is your plan? You want me to give you a gun, you're going to shoot him, then take off, and then I lose my badge? No, I need, I need a gun out there. Well, hey, I watched this movie one time where, where the, the bad guy disarmed the good guy and, and also uh, killed him with, a, with nothing more than a pen. You could always try that with Franco if it comes to it. You really suggesting I kill Franco with a pen? No, I'm not suggesting you kill Franco with a pen. I'm suggesting maybe you walk out of here in police custody with any luck. Franco sees it, comes out of hiding, and I arrest him. Yeah, well, stopping Franco is not going to be easy as busting Michael. Well, actually, maybe I got Michael put in here, but I definitely got him yeah, out of here. Yeah, and now you want to catch Franco, so you're the hero, right? So everyone forgets that you're a liar. Well, I don't know. Do you want to be a part no, of I'm not walking out in front not? of a serial killer unarmed just to make you look good. I'll keep you covered at all times. So you're going to keep a gun on me and bust Franco at the same time? Yeah, I'm a pretty good multitasker. Franco wants me. I can stop him. Why not just let me? So you're going to kill him and then turn the gun on me? No. You're going to have to trust me, just like you're asking me to trust I, you. I don't trust you. That's where the problem's going to be. You don't understand how Franco thinks. We're not talking about a brilliant strategist here. We're talking about a sick person who kills people. I can see that. That's why I have the advantage over you in this situation. That's why I'm going to catch him when you haven't. Okay. Just don't underestimate him. Let just be the bait. Franco shows up. I'll take over from there. It's not going to work. I'll be back tomorrow. Is there a problem with the paperwork? Is that why you requested a meeting? says I can't carry a gun. And that's a surprise to you? I'm agreeing to help you catch a serial killer. You can't really expect me to go out there unprotected. I can't release a known hitman, even temporarily, and put a gun in his hand. But Franco wants to make me defend myself. That's the game. Kill or be killed. If we give you a gun, you could take a hostage and escape. Or, you know, Franco could just show up and slit my throat because that would be his style. Then you make one of those dumb videos about it and call it art and get even more famous. But it wouldn't matter because I'd be dead and so would your career. Next time we were here, is it Michael? Is it Ontario? They're fine. Um, you probably know everything I'm about to say, but Franco has resurfaced, and Dante convinced Claire Walsh to let him use Jason as bait to catch him. J Jason's out of prison? Yeah, he's going to be in Dante's custody, which means if Jason makes a run for it, Dante could lose his badge. He could even end up in prison. What do you want? I'm asking you to make sure that Jason doesn't escape. I'm doing this for Dante. He, he, he would never ask me to do this. He doesn't even know that I'm here. Well, uh, you're assuming that uh, Dante losing his badge is a, is a bad thing. If Dante loses his badge, he will lose a part of himself, and I'm asking you not to let that happen. I, I'm pretty sure I can keep Jason from running. Thank you. Well, you know, it's not going to be like before where I supported you because your dad was a great friend of mine and we, we had history together lately you've been kind of treating me a certain way so if I'm going to do something for you I need something back what do you want? if I keep Jason from running will you stop talking me down to my kids even Dante good point about Franco, who knows what the guy will do, but there is no way I can agree to let you carry a weapon. I could lose my job if you escape. Okay, it wouldn't make sense for me to escape. I got two years here. I can do two years. You could be here as long as okay, five. if I run, I'll never be able to come home. I'll, I'll have to cut the ties to everybody that I love. Look, I respect the fact that you put yourself here to protect Michael. You obviously love him very much, 
but you have to appreciate what you're asking here. Would you like to go up against a serial killer unarmed? We are just going to run you out to a press conference and hope that Franco takes the bait. Yeah, and I'll be out of prison until he does, right? Yes, and you will not carry a firearm under any circumstances. All, all I want to do is defend myself. That's it. Mr. Morgan, your reputation doesn't always work in your favor. And I'll admit that part of me would love for you to kill Franco and escape. I'd like nothing better than to track you down, put you on trial, and send you to prison for the rest of your life. And if the Corinthos trial had gone differently, maybe I could take that risk. But as it is, my credibility is shot. But if I can stop Franco, I'm golden. No, oh, hold on. Any agenda that you bring to this, Franco will use it against if you. If you don't want to help us catch Franco, by all means don't. But if you agree to help, it's on our terms. I got you some double caramel crunch. Okay, thank you. So what do you want to do for dinner? Uh, well, we can have pizza or Chinese or anything. Well, I was thinking of cooking. Well, we can order out. I'm gonna try and not be insulted. <laughs> no, I just meant I don't, I don't want you to put yourself out. No, it's fine, I wanna stay busy. You went to see my dad, didn't you? How do you know? You're worried about Dante. You're afraid if Jason runs off, he can lose his badge. And my dad can tell him not to run. You are very smart. It's not fair, though. Jason shouldn't have to spend years in Pentonville because he came there to help me. Hey. Well, it is official. Jason gets out of Pentonville tomorrow until we catch Franco and then he goes back. There's gotta be another way. Well, Franco's obsessed with Jason. I mean, if we leak it to the media that, that he's getting out, Franco will probably show his face in a matter of hours. Once Jason double crosses, he even tries to run. That's, Jason's not going anywhere. Well, that's what Sonny said, and I, I hope it's true. You talked to Sonny? I wanted him to guarantee that Jason wouldn't try to escape. Why the hell would you ask Sonny for anything? I didn't ask you to go to Sonny and plead my case on my behalf. But if Jason runs, you could go to prison. No, 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 I know what I stand to lose. But after what Franco did to you, I'm not gonna stop till I catch the guy. I don't think you understand how much Jason hates you. Oh, yeah, I do, I believe me, he wants me dead. He's wanted me dead for a very long okay, time. Okay, then why'd you agree to a plan that makes it so easy for him to get revenge? What am I supposed to do? Franco's back. He's obsessed with Jason. Throwing Jason in front of the media is the quickest way to catch No one's guy. asking you to risk everything to catch Franco. So, I'm sorry. In other words, thank you, Dante. Thank you for trying to save my life. Oh, my gosh. If, if, if Jason runs and you get sent to prison, which is probably going to happen, you're going to be throwing away your life. Baby, that's my risk to take. What about me? Do you not get it? If you throw away your life, you're throwing away mine, too. Your son is the most stubborn guy I've met in my whole life. He's gonna send himself to prison to keep me safe, and I don't want him to do it, but there's nothing I can do about it. Wow, that must have been some fight. Congratulations. You heard. Franco might be good for something after all if he can get you out of here. It happened pretty fast. There's no way I'm gonna be able to take care of Anthony. No, don't worry about it. I'm. I'm I'm taking care of Johnny in a way that can't be traced back to me. But I want to be clear on something. I want you to give me your word that after you're done with Franco, you won't run. 